Sutinemak, 1935, 7 March 1990, was a prominent Turkish journalist and columnist, who was assassinated. Early life He was born to Selim Rakp Emak, journalist and later co-founder of the Democratic Party, and his wife Rabia Emak. He had two sisters, Zeynep and Layla, and a brother, AYDN. After finishing the Galatasaray High School, Emak studied law at Istanbul University. In 1952, he entered journalism at his father's newspaper Sun Posta as a reporter. After the 1960 Turkish coup d'etat, he became the leader of the newspaper, since his father was in prison for his membership in the parliament and the political party, which was on the government at that time. He served later as editor in chief at the popular weekly magazine Sayayat and Says until 1972. Between 1972 and 1984, Amak was the executive editor of the liberal rightist Daily Hurriyat. In 1984, he switched to another major newspaper mill yet that lasted until 1986. He returned to Hurriyat Media Group to become its coordinator and chief columnist. He was appointed also a member of the board. Assassination Satin Amak was assassinated in the morning of March 7, 1990 in front of his home in Swadiyai. Istanbul as he got in his car to go to his office. Two gunmen wearing ski mask and sunglasses approached the car he was already seating in. While one gunman opened the right back door and fired his gun with silencer, the other one shot from the left back door's window. His driver, Sinan Erkin, tried to escape, however, was shot down as well. Severely injured by seven bullets, Sutin Amak was taken to a nearby hospital. However, it has been declared that he died already during the transportation. His driver died at the crime scene. Soon after the attack, someone called the newspaper Hurriyat and told that he was calling on behalf of the organization Turk Islam Commandilar Berligi, literally, Union of Turkish Islamist Commandos, an Iranian based militant group, and took on the responsibility for the murder of Satin Emek, adding they will kill everyone in the newspaper. During the day, someone, who spoke clear Turkish language, called Hariyat's office in Berlin, Germany and said, We killed Satin Emek. Devsal, literally, Revolutionary People's Liberation Party Front, a Marxist-Leninist militant organization. Emek was buried at the Zinserlikayu Cemetery in Istanbul. His murder remains so far unsolved. Sisadil Eaton Emek was survived by his wife Bilge, a daughter Mevz and a son Mehmet, Memo. Mevz Emek became a notable classical pianist. Memo Emek is the general manager of Vyland. Legacy A football stadium in Bayram Paza, Istanbul and several streets across the country are named after him. See also list of unsolved murders. References